guys welcome to today today i'm going crazy and i'm going to tell you guys why okay let's go show them so you guys know our girls are in heat turns out penny likes to talk when she's in heat you guys hear her? she's calling out to us she's like you better come and do what i say right now so we're in this we're in the house doing school work you guys going in going in i have never heard anything like it before in my life you guys i mean i have heard but not from our horses our horses don't do this so basically yes, apparently. she is just calling out she's and like calling out <laughs> she's like i am coming listen these are the rules you're the horse yeah, you don't tell us what today. to do yeah she'd be loving everyone she doesn't like you that much don't be offended. She's just head shy, Sophie. If you I know, like, but like she's actually letting me pat her until I kissed her when she's walking away. Yeah, like people, she seems standoffish unless she likes you, and it puts people off. And I hate that. But what can you do? Listen, you got to stop calling us, Penny Pickle. So uh, they're done their morning hay, and they're not going onto grass until it's time for their afternoon hay. And we do that because we want to keep their weight good. We've been, knock on wood, doing so well. I want to keep them healthy, especially her rehabbing um, an injury. That means to me that, she, like, especially her rehabbing an injury, I want her not to put so much, I, don't, I want her to be a good weight so she's not putting a ton of pressure on that injury. So it's so super important. And you guys know how fast they get fat on grass. So we're doing it in a in a controlled way so that they can have as much grass as they want and still be healthy. She is down here screaming her head off. Like, just screaming her head off. It's like one of those games where the horses are... Yeah, that's nagging. what she sounds like. She's like, nay! Like when they paw. She's like, get me to the grass! <laughs> Penny Pickle, you gotta wait. You gotta wait. Let's see if we walk away if she'll do it. But yeah, I've never like... It's, there's so much pressure <laughs> calling you before they used to stand at the gate and watch us now she'd be calling us okay. listen Shh. ruby come she can see us <laughs> you have to turn the lights off, right? yeah i know <laughs> So I've never had a horse be so talkative. So her, if you guys don't know, the Palomino and the Paint are both in heat, just causing trouble. Willow might be in heat. Willow's not in heat yet. Penny, you'd be such a good show horse if you talk like that all the time. What do we do with her? Like we can't stay in the bar the whole day. She's just down there calling us. Penny! <laughs> she's staring at the grass. I know, she wants a boy, I think. Maybe she wants to go on a walk. She's like a teenage girl. She's thinking she wants a boyfriend. Alright, we are at our tax store for our weekly stuff. And we found uh, Molly's sister dog. Molly's litter mate. <laughs> so we found some new grain buckets actually and they're really cute because they come in colors and you guys be knowing that Gracie oh they're for they're for puppies I don't know what are they? what the heck are they hoof proof oh for horses uh, you guys know Gracie be destroying ours Kaylee has this ergonomic hoof pick see it's got the weird shape to it bends and they hate it Gabby's loading up on piece T. Penny sees us. Here she comes. There's like so much wasted hay because all they want is the grass right now. Hi, Penny Pickle. 
It's not time yet. It's too early. It's too early for grass. I like to leave them on the grass for a long time, so I wait so that I can make it so that it's not too far between meals, if that makes sense. Took Sam's car and we were able to get a ton of shavings, you guys. So much better. Normally I end up going every single week and just getting six shavings each time because that's all I can fit in my van. But Sam was home and I was able to go and get a ton. So that's good. Also, I want to show you guys when I was saying that the bug spray that I buy costs hundred dollars It's $89.99. So it's like 90 bucks plus tax. So it's probably even over a hundred bucks This is the one that I get it's a this will get me three Bottles of bug spray and that's why I buy it and I end up using about three of these every season So if you buy three Then you won't have to go buy more. I know but I mean who wants to spend three hundred dollars all at once on bug spray me I like spending. I know you do. Oh, if you love her, she will love you. Oh, see, she pulls back all the time. She's not a, she's head shy a bit, and it makes people not like her, and it hurts my heart because I just want everybody to like her. I want people to like her as much as I like her, and I really like her. I have a, I have three of these bottles, and I always fill them. One I keep in our tack trunk for. Oh. One I keep in our tack trunk for the shows. Ooh. One I keep at the other barn, which I'm gonna have to fill that one. And one I keep here for us to use. See, that's why I only last three bottles, because yeah. she pours all of it out. Today I'm wasting it. I need to get a funnel. Also, the saddle guy messaged me back. I messaged him again. Wow, look at all of our shavings. The saddle guy also messaged me back. You guys know I did a video a couple of years ago when we bought Sophie's new saddle. I wanted to come and check our saddle fit because you should do that every once in a while and possibly see about what we could do for Storm. Like you guys know I would go riding a lot more with the girls if we all could have a saddle. Um, none of our other saddles fit Storm like our Western saddles. So, I don't think I'd buy another custom saddle, but they often have like used ones that they have for sale that look almost brand new. So I might do that. I don't know, anyway, he's gonna come see what we can do if the saddle still fit our boys. Yeah, so that's exciting, that's new, that's happening. We'll be back, Penny Pickle. <laughs> She's like, don't forget about me, bring me a boyfriend. All right, so we are back home. School is done, but the girls are not allowed to have their phone. Until a certain time, Cute. and so Sophie's finding something to do. She's been um, coloring. I asked people on TikTok. I have a bunch of photos here, and I asked people on TikTok. Look, how come you're not this organized with your schoolwork? She's got like organization galore here. All these photos. A lot of photos that she printed. All her and crayons, everything's all beautiful. She's yeah, got a nice I mean, little workstation. I need more markers. I, this black marker is really good. They have some really fun markers and on I Amazon. Asked people, what photo and like what color the horses are or like the jumps and stuff because there's jump ones. I'm just waiting on the color for the horse on that one. And I've colored one of these already. I colored this one last night. I like doing the bridles. Just don't you? Black. Don't you? And I have that one. And I have her. A bunch of She's trying to sound like a teacher. She's going. Good. Maybe she'll be a teacher one day. All right, come on. We're going down to the bar. A lot of what you do in the future is what you do now, what you practice now. Maybe she will be a teacher. Who knows? Anyway, we're going down to the barn. We're going to shoot a TikTok that I've been wanting to shoot. The puppy. There comes a time when the puppy has to be trained by everybody and not just Sophie because we all take turns to like bring her down to the barn. Stay. Stay. This is very boring for her. There we go. So anyways, that's what we've been working on. I'm at the point with her where I can let, make her sit and walk away. Yeah, she's doing if really I, well. If I get too far out of her range where she can't see me, she starts to freak out like, oh my God, I don't know what she's Yeah, doing. and that's like a thing too for her. Like, she always, Gabby, be wasting the bug spray. Like, she thinks it's perfume. Oh, I need it smells good though. You There's no perfume. bug spray. There's you no spray, bugs. Spray and I'll walk All right. Through. So anyway, we're gonna do our. Wait, I gotta get the. I gotta get the tripod. Then we're gonna do a you fun TikTok. 
Uh, before we get started with the TikTok, I forgot to tell you guys, boy, Cat was here last night. Sam came down to feed, sent us all pictures of him. I'll send, I'll show you guys a couple of pictures. But he was home last night, so he's just a traveling boy. Do you guys know the drill? We did this with our dogs. We did this with our kids. We love this TikTok. Okay, so put, hold, both of you put your hands on her close to her face. Yeah. Okay, on the mark, on the count of three. One, two, three. One, two, three. This summer I'll be by your side. Mom, I have the favor here. I wonder that you can describe. She only goes one direction. And she doesn't go fast. Mo's a funny runner. <laughs> no, I literally follow Sophia, then I see you running. Mom's a funny runner. And then I look back and Penny psychs Sophia out. I'm looking out, it's really far I felt the tingle in my heart a... so, I probably look funnier running, trust me, but... Okay, three, two, one, go! the wind that was bonkers like I feel like the ponies were like mm, I'll just go wherever I can go fastest Penny decided you guys she was like she decided she was like when she just went like the ponies wherever she could go she just went and then she realized what was happening and she did turned around and came right to me and then when the girls did it together she just stood there staring at me and then she started walking toward me but the camera was between us and i don't know what she decided but she decided she to decided that you have a thing to hold it so she's like oh no like that like my horse loves me like i used to tell you guys i do not know if stella loved me i i i believe she no, did yeah, I do not think she loved me best, that's for sure. But you know what? Penny loves me and she loves me best. In this lonely place, I still see your face. I go round and round until every sound is a symphony from my heart. And this, my friends, is why we don't store shavings at our barn. You guys thought it was because we didn't have enough space, but really it's because Gabby thinks she's a five-year-old boy. I'm not. Ten-year-old boy. She is a ten-year-old boy. I'm not. I'm good. Oh my god, I can spot oh, there's spider webs. <laughs> Let's see jump down now. I'm gonna hurt my feet. Yeah. How are you getting down? Oh, I'll just slide. All right, slide. All right. Uh-oh. This one's more stable than this one. Oh, I can just climb down. Not just sliding. We I'm coming up. <laughs> How do you do that? It's really hard. You gotta put your knee on it and then just like. I've been seeing comments where people are saying like, this is a big, huge mess. And that. Oh my lord. Put Gracie's bridle away. 
and that they don't like how we have all this stuff. They think that we should pack it all into boxes, like our boxes we've over there. We've done that. <laughs> yeah, we've done that. So the reason yeah, that, boxes. so I don't know if it's a difference in climate or what, but if you pack leather in a box like that, where there's no air or no ventilation, they mold. So we bought some secondhand mm -hmm. stuff that have been like that and molded. But look at this is storms. Old. Extra. And this is Stella's. But I agree, you guys. This definitely needs a cleanup. So, like, I don't think we should have our halters here. They should go out on their stall. We have the halters just in case they get free again. Yeah, on their stall? Because that one time, nobody could figure out where their halters were. You had them all. Where? On you. Oh. When the gellings got loose. Oh. And ran in that field. I was over there. And then they were all just like, oh, hi. All right, so what are we going to do? Let's sort through this mess. Oh, uh, that was not, we did not agree. We did not agree. It's we true. We did not agree. We we're doing it. Let's go. Well Basically, that's all we have. We definitely cleaned it up. Yeah. So this stuff is all going to get put away someplace. So uh, that's my section. I have a section. Hey, this I, is mine. This is too big to fit my horse because he has a small head. Where'd you get it? Bridal pad. All right. So basically, uh, we're going to, I think you should hang that up and put your bridles in it, your extra bridles in it so that they don't get dusty. They already no. are dusty. They're already dusty. So anyways, um, we do clean our tack often. And they're super well oiled. The ones that are brand new are still working themselves in. Um, a little bit of dust, that's all that's on them, is a little bit of dust, which is a lot better. In there? Yeah. No, let's look and see what you're throwing in here. All right. Halters. This lead rope is good. Put the lead ropes in. This halter's broken. My horse broke it. I love that though. Can I fix it? You tried, you can't. No, I probably can. Let me see. No, you tried. Is this the same color I have? No. It is. It's no, Loma. You have burgundy. Why aren't we throwing it away if it's... Because I'm keeping it. Yeah. Hoarder. Uh, I don't know. I'm wondering if this would fit Gracie. Uh, it's a regular horse size. That will not fit Gracie. That yeah, not. I don't think it will fit Gracie. I don't think it will fit Gracie, but I have to buy another one in case Gracie needs one. No. So the plan this summer is to have a huge yard sale. Hopefully we move by the fall. That's the plan. That's the plan, you guys, barring COVID issues. Um, you don't use it though. What is that? Any of uh, the yeah, the driving stuff, keep that out because we're going to work on driving again soon. I, I need to get a cart. That's my goal. So we put a lot of lead ropes in there, but we always use extra lead ropes. Like we always, they break and we always end up needing more. So uh, we're probably, so we're not going to sell any of those, but we are going to have a yard sale this summer and we're going to sell a bunch of stuff. We're going to clean the room the a bit yard better. yard sale is my idea. Yeah. And um, so this is it, you guys. You won't have to look at the big, huge mess anymore. I mean, it's still kind of a mess. We're not selling Stella. No, we're not selling Stella. Why is my section the most full? We can't sell her. Because you have all the driving stuff. So that's it. There's my section. Gabby's section is all in here for her two horses. And then Sophie's section. Three. I, I want to use this again sometime. Well, two horses. But it needs to be washed. Because it's still dirty. We'll bring it up to the house and I'll wash it. But I probably won't wear it. Then put it in the bucket. It's not getting packed away. It's too special. That honestly is another reason that we don't pack very many things away because out of sight, out of mind. When we first moved here, um, a lady messaged me and she said, Laura, here's a picture of my tack room. Keep everything out. Keep everything out. As soon as you pack it away, you're not going to use it. And it's true. So 
We hardly ever go through our buckets. We end up just buying new stuff, which is a bad thing. Mm -hmm. So anyway, we're done. We, we cleaned it up a little bit. Next step is for us to oil everything and clean everything. We do that at least once a year, like for the stuff that we don't use. And then the stuff we do use, we, use, we clean a lot. How yeah, often? the tack that we do use, we clean a lot. Like, How often do you clean your boots? How often do you clean your boots? I cleaned them yesterday. Like I just rubbed them down with using your boot polish because I told Fiona and I promised her that I would clean them. But up until yesterday, when, how often were you cleaning your boots? When I first got them, two times a week maybe. How often do you clean your and boots? Now, like, Whenever they're dirty. So if they're dusty, I clean them. But if I clean them and then use them and they're not that dirty, I don't clean them. Yeah, Gabby mostly cleans them every single day. You she don't over clean. Yeah, that's true. All right, that's it. Let's pack it up. Don't you know that you're beautiful?